I'm stunned. Oh, he takes me down. We go down for the first time. All right, we're defeated. All right, so this is the stage. All right, let's see what happens now. Do we edit team? Oh, how do we level up our characters? All right, so let's go ahead and level up our What's character. What's up, guys? Professor Showtime here with another video about Adventure Time Heroes. Guys, I'm having a blast playing this game. It's so much fun. Today, we're going to take an in-depth look at equipment. As you guys know, I'm brand new to the game, but I'm learning alongside with you. So I'm just going to pass on the knowledge that I'm learning so you guys can get a head start of what you're doing. So, just like every other gacha game, equipment matters, and it matters a lot. It basically can help your character get stronger. As you guys know, in this game, in order to level up your hero, so let's click on hero. In order to upgrade your hero or to level them up, if you click on upgrade, you're gonna need fodder heroes or duplicate heroes or heroes that aren't needed, that, that you are not gonna use. See, right now we don't have any heroes that I can add to them to merge them together to make this hero stronger. So the other way that you can, the other thing that you can do is it, it attach equipment to this to this character, but in this game they're called trinkets. So if you click on the trinkets button right here, you can attach trinkets to them. So how do you get trinkets? Well, just by playing stages, you get tr trinkets. You can also get trinkets from the shop. So let's go to the marketplace. Click on market and they're there. So right now you see this life body that's 10,000 gold or the top one, the offensive gauntlet, which is 93,000 gold, which is a lot of gold for me because I'm just starting out. Right now I have 78,000, so I don't have enough to get that. Um, I'm pretty sure I could get it if I wanted to. Let's just for the purpose of this video, let's see if we can unlock that now. Unlock, oh, it's unlock, it's a slot. That's what, that's a slot. Okay, so let's unlock that slot. All right, so boom. So now that slot is unlocked. Alrighty. And there's a life body that is gonna actually, actually cost 81,000 gold, and we don't have enough of that. Let me show you guys what the slot is that I'm, that I'm talking about. So with the heroes, you go to trinkets, which is, which is uh, equipment with trinkets. You're gonna click on that. And now you see there are slots there, right? So there's six slots that we have that are that are unlocked, and uh, you can actually switch them out. So if I click on this purple item that I have right there, it's gonna go side by side with the item that I have that I have attached. So the first item is a common item that I have attached right now. It's the weapon, and it has the stat that it gives me is 269 HP. And also you see below that it says two set HP plus 15%. That means if I have two green items or two life set items, that's what they call them that here, two life set items, I'm going to get a bonus 15% HP. So if you look in the upper right corner where it says total stats and you see I have one H, you see I mean one heart there, that one heart means that I have one heart set or one life set. And if you look at my equipment, I'm going to have these boots and I'm gonna have this weapon these are the two green or the two life life set so that's one set since I have two of them that's why I have one heart I have two two yellows there because I have um, four yellow equipment each two actually makes one set I hope that makes sense that's why I have two two yellows and the, the set bonus I get for the yellow one is uh, two set is defense plus 15 percent so i'm gonna get plus 15 percent twice so it should be like plus 30 percent i think correct me if i'm wrong so let's look at let's go back to looking at what we were looking at the uh purple item which is the which is the speed set versus the life set the speed set is an epic weapon it's purple it's gonna give me five percent defensive boost five percent hp boost and 28 defense but only a plus 19 attack. The life set I ha have now, the green one, gives me 269 HP. And it gives me a plus 2%, plus 15% if I have two of them. I'm gonna opt to keep the uh, life set right now. I could be wrong for doing this because I'm thinking 269 raw HP and the plus 15% HP is gonna be better than the plus 19 weapon attack that I would get. I could be wrong. You guys let me know in the comment section. I mean, if I did have another purple, I probably would uh, 
or another speed set, I probably would attach that weapon, but since I don't, I'm not going to do that. So that's that. Um, if you look at if you look at another character, so let's look at this character right here. He has nothing on him, right? This is my look kind of like a fighter unit. I'm gonna go ahead and equip some stuff to him just because I know I shouldn't do it, but for the purpose of the video, I am going to. So I'm gonna put this green one, this life helmet. I'm gonna equip it. I'm gonna equip the uh, shield. I'm going to equip the gauntlets and I'm going to equip the body, right? Notice if I wanted to remove one of these, right? Let's see if I click on the life set and I want it to remove. If I click remove, it's going to actually charge me 1300 gold to remove it. So in this game, what you want to do is like my grandmother taught me, you want to measure twice and cut once. You, you don't want to equip. You don't want to you don't want to equip equipment willy-nilly you want to make sure that's the equipment that you want because if not is they're going to charge you for removing the equipment and i can imagine that could get really expensive especially when it comes to the epic gear i don't know i don't know if it scales to the epic gear and the legendary gear but i would imagine it does so so make sure that the equipment that you equip is the right equipment that you want with that being said also, once you once you uh, equip the equipment, you can also upgrade your equipment, and that's also going to cost gold. So let's go ahead and do that. It's going to cost 600 gold once to level it up. Is the success rate 1,200 gold the second time? And if you can see, it, it, there's actually an upgrade chance. So there's a chance that it's not going to be successful. So we did that three times. Right now, it's 100% chance, and I'm assuming because it's a lower item it's only a common item or it's a low level item but i'm pretty sure once they go higher in rarity or higher in levels it's actually gonna be more let's see if what happens if i click the upgrade button upgrade to level four it's gonna cost me 2400 gold to do that is that was is that what's gonna happen no i don't know if, if i'm clicking one level upgrade i don't know if it's actually Doing something. If I put eight there, I guess it's upgrading it automatically. Yeah, it's upgrading it automatically. Wow. So that's instead of doing it by itself. See if it just failed. All right. So let's. Uh, I just went through a lot of gold to do that, but actually, let's cancel. Yeah, I just ate my gold up. Wow. So we just learned. We're canceling. We're canceling. We're canceling. All right. So we level that up pretty harshly and uh, yeah, we just learned what that button does. Okay. All right. So let's upgrade the other one. We're only going to do it twice. 600 gold, 1200 gold. We did it twice. We have 19,000 gold left. We can upgrade this right here. The gauntlets, 500 gold, upgrade it once, upgrade it twice. It just makes me stronger. All right. And I think that's everything. All right, so we've so this character right now now has some trinkets, some equipment, and there you have it, guys. And you guys see in the upper right hand corner where it says total stats. He has two green stats, and it's because he has four green trinkets. So these four trinkets actually gives him two stats. So it's going to give me a bonus of plus fifteen percent, plus fifteen percent. Of plus 15% plus 15% and that's because there are two each of them So guys, this is equipment You want to make sure you like I said you want to make sure you equip the right equipment that you want to use Because if you have to take it off, it's gonna cost you gold that button to the side of it where it says um Where it says the level upgrade it's actually it's actually like a quality of life feature It's gonna save you if you want to do multiple upgrades at the same time, but be careful that the equipments don't always upgrade because there's a chance that it might fail and the percentage is going to be up there while you're doing it. Guys, if you like Adventure Time Heroes content, go ahead and sub to the channel, click the like button, but most importantly, let me know in the comment section down below that you want more Adventure Time Heroes. If you want to know how to download the game, let me know. Hit me up on Discord or hit me up on the Reddit. I'll leave the links in the, in the description above. Until next time, guys. Peace.